Rubber begins to melt at around 120 degrees Celsius, but water boils at 100 degrees Celsius. When a flame touches a balloon inflated with air, the rubber weakens quickly, so the balloon pops. But when the flame touches the balloon filled with water, the balloon doesn't pop; it only gets blackened. That's because most of the thermal energy is transferred to the water instead of the rubber. Water has a specific heat capacity of 4,200 joules per kilogram degree Celsius, whereas rubber's is 1,600 joules per kilogram degree Celsius. Water's large specific heat capacity means that it requires a large amount of heat to raise its temperature. Water will absorb the thermal energy of the flame as its temperature rises slowly. The temperature of the rubber cannot rise any faster than the temperature of the water. So as long as you keep the temperature of the water in the balloon below 100 degrees Celsius, the rubber's temperature will not rise above 100 degrees Celsius. So the balloon with water will not reach its melting point, and therefore will not pop.